it, it's been special to be the first uh, full-time commissioner for the UMAC, though. Uh, I think important to note, certainly, uh, Jim Unke had really laid the groundwork for uh, myself to step in and, and continue the great work that he had done. And so uh, it was a neat opportunity, uh, especially the first few years, to begin uh, shaping our conference as far as policy, procedure, structure, uh, how do we want our governance to look like, um, to be able to uh, kind of a, a, a clean marker board, if you will, and uh, help shape that certainly was very fulfilling. Probably in year two or three uh, in my position, uh, I realized uh, from a conference membership standpoint, that some people have probably heard me say this, the, the one thing we have in common is we have nothing in common. Uh, and so we're still able to make it work and we're able to keep growing and developing I think uh, primarily because of our great people that make up the UMAC. And so that's certainly been the most um, rewarding, enjoyable part over the last 10 years is working with uh, the different administrators and coaches, um, others that are a part of our, our conference membership. Without a doubt, uh, that is the rewarding part. I think the UMAC has probably impacted me or, or had a more of an impact on my life than, than uh, maybe flipping it the other way. You know, there's a, a quote I have up in my office from Colin Powell that says, the, uh, the day people stop bringing you problems is the day that you've uh, stopped leading them. And so I think in our conference office, we've always viewed that as uh, one of our top priorities is trying to help uh, do what we can from the conference office as far as um, adding value, helping try to solve institutional challenges. And so uh, I guess looking back someday, I hope that's what um, stands out to people that uh, our conference staff and myself was able to impact their life in some way. Maybe it was just professionally work, maybe it was personally, but that uh, we were able to add value in, in whatever they were uh, trying to accomplish.